We're going to look at two turning moves with the swords in free position. And I am going to get myself into position. And what we're going to look at is the barrel turn and the Sara turn. And this is what they look like. And let me break that down a little bit for you. Um, we do the barrel turn, and I'm going to start with my arms in free position, right, right sword behind. Um, the reason we have the right sword behind is because when we go into balancing, we always put the right sword down first, and that should be in the back position. Also, um, on several of these moves, it makes it easier to flow into the other moves um, with, with the right sword behind. Um, that could be a stylization of mine, so learn it that way for um, the homecoming performance uh, and be open to anything else that anybody teaches you, particularly Melody, because she is beautiful with double swords. But this is how um, we will do it. I'm going to get into position and then I will just demonstrate those two moves. break those moves down to you a little bit. We'll start with the barrel turn. I'm going to get swords in free position, not appropriately, but get them up there. So the barrel turn, we're going to start with the arms overhead. I'm going to take a large trajectory slicing down the right side of the wall, up the left side of the wall, large trajectory down the right side of the wall, and up the other side of the wall. And then we'll finish it off with a lovely florea, ending with the right sword behind the left. So this is what it looks like again. And what I want uh, you to pay attention to is um, when we come, when we are, we've done the first, we're in the back. What I want you to do, instead of just dropping this elbow to your side, I want you to make sure that you make a wide trajectory um, on that turn. Uh, because it's, we want to use up uh, as much space and it looks beautiful when we have all that. Um, extension going on with the, with the swords, with the props. So the Sara turn, we're going to start overhead and we're just going to drop them down to our right hip as we go into our first angle. The right sword is going to go overhead just like in the regular Sara and come back again at our left hip. It is then going to rise overhead, and as we rise it, we're going to bring the other sword up. So you notice how they're sort of tip to tip. So we're going to make this nice tip to tip trajectory. Come around here. We're going to hold this right sword stable as we bring our left sword down to it. And then we're going to end by drawing the right sword overhead 
and look at how we're in this beautiful frame position. So we can easily go in to an isolation as we transition to another move. Thank you, ladies.